made you decide to get back together again? Money. No, money. <laughs> money. No. But it was a factor. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> For me personally, um, you know, I had such a bad time, which sounds really negative, um, and it was so overwhelming when I was a kid uh -huh. that I just felt, like, not satisfied. Yeah. I wanted to come back, do it properly, do it yeah, correctly. Yeah, yeah. Um, so bad? Just an overwhelming experience, you know, when you're a child. Um, just never had time to absorb it, really take it in. Or appreciate enjoy it. Or appreciate yeah. it yeah. properly. How old were you when all this fame sort of came to you? Uh, Scott and I were 17 and Sean was 15. 15? <laughs> oh, I'm oh still in gosh. school. Jeez. Because, well, you know, we were all talking about this oh. this morning, weren't we? So we really do sympathise because I think a lot of people just go, oh, pop stars, you've got it all. Oh, what are they moaning about? All that money. But we really do see, we'll often interview mm. people, won't we? We know they've mm. travelled, like, through the night. It's mm. exhausting. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I mean, for me, uh, you know, I think between 15 and 20, you really start to find out who you are as a person. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Whereas, I can't speak for other people, but for me personally, I didn't really get a time to no. discover who Sean Conlon is, which sounds mm. oh, cheesy. No, 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 it doesn't. I was just Sean from five every day, yeah. Yeah. wearing clothes that yeah. I probably wouldn't have worn. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 and yeah. not able to make any mistakes. Yeah. And, and it sounds so. stupid, but as a kid, you just, like... It doesn't sound stupid at, at no. all. And to be, I mean, my, my son is 16, and when I think of, you know, mentally how where he is at maturity level, whether he'd be able to cope with that, I don't know how you did it. Well, we, we look at your, we look I've at your got son, a don't we? Old boy, Brennan, and um, and I think if he was doing it now, I mean, he, he can just about make beans on toast. <gasps> yeah. Would you, would you let him do it? Beans on toast. Only beans on toast. Why are brown? Um, uh, well, I'm not eating bread at the moment, you know. I'm gonna kick, uh, yeah. But no, no I wouldn't. So you can fit um, in those I, jeans. I couldn't say I wouldn't let him do it because he writes songs and he plays the guitar and he, you know he's very good at that and he, he likes singing. Yeah. So I'm sort of dealing with that at the moment, you know, like would he want to do it? And, do you have um, a fear of him coming to you and saying that? Yeah. Um, well, he, he sort of has. He said to me, like, last year, oh, I'm thinking of doing this, I might go on, you know, try it for X Factor or whatever, and I was like, oh, hang on, Bren, you know. Mm, yeah. So I would support him, but I, I know it sounds stupid that I've not got a proper job, but I want him to get a proper job. Yeah. He's very clever. You know, and uh, we're very blessed proper that he's... Would, would you go everywhere with him? Because... Um, yeah, well, yeah, to a certain degree, I would, I'd want to sort of help him not do the things that we don't, you know, like make sure that he's been looked after, mm. the record company not taking advantage, make yeah. sure he's getting some sleep. Well, it's a bit the same for you, Richie, because you've got a little girl, haven't you? Yeah, I mean, I've got a long way yet. She's only three. Mm. Yeah. But I would, I definitely would, you know, be, be nervous if she was starting to go that way. Um, yeah, definitely. I would just wouldn't want her to go. I know the pitfalls, I know all yeah. of that. Also, I think as a father to a daughter as well, as that extra yeah. little bit of... So what were you guys before. thrown into? What were these four years like? Uh, the years of the band? Yeah. yeah. Um, I mean, you know, we had also the, the, the band dynamic as well, for me, was another big pressure, but it was manic, majorly stressful. There were some beautiful moments winning the Brits performing on MTV Awards was amazing. I, I mean, yeah. you know, performing with Queen, amazing. 18-hour work days. But 18-hour yeah. work days. And, 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 and the thing is, at that age, well, we all know that you get drink thrown at you the whole time for oh, free. Yeah. Don't you mind take that. any 15... You know that too well, <laughs> don't you? <laughs> Listen, we're not saying no to the free yeah, but not at 15. No, 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 no. No, no, no. no. no, no. <laughs> also, we, <laughs> didn't do it. <laughs> we, we, had, we had abs on uh, last week as well, and obviously he, he clearly suffered as well yeah. through that yeah. time, and drugs was a, a problem for him. Was yeah. that something that was a problem for you guys as well? I think we all had our own ways of dealing with yeah, things, yeah. you know, uh, and it came out... I mean, I reclused for years after the band. I literally moved away to the countryside. And if I'm honest, it took me until the big reunion to fully get my head back around to actually being able to face doing it again. Because, yeah. Richard, uh, you were drinking a lot, weren't you? That I was your, did That drink... was how you sort of dealt with the fame and the money away from your parents. It was it more you... so after the band. Like, yeah, you'd go to the party, but I, I, I realised that I was in an unhealthy situation because I was drinking... I wasn't an alcoholic, but I was drinking to knock myself off how I felt. Yeah. yeah. And be able yeah. to have a little, I don't know, chill myself out. And that's, it, I don't think yeah. that's healthy, has, doing it every day. Yeah. It has an effect on everyone in different ways, as Rich said. Like, for me, I, you know, I, I, I enjoy a drink and, and still do but the fact is that even now at 38 years old social anxiety I get and if I'm if I go to a bar I need to know who's there is anyone looking at me blah blah, blah. I mm. need to sit in a certain chair and make sure that mm. it, and it still happens now yeah. you know so doing stuff it sort of does change you when you're in a band like five yeah. but it's would you do it again 
Boy, they are different yeah. again. Yeah, are. yeah, we are. <laughs> Would you? We are, but you know what? We're, we're, no, but I guess... if you had your time again, knowing Looking what you back. know. Oh, uh, because we do it so... We, you know, we do the, all the music the same and stuff like that, oh. but I think more the business decisions yeah. Yeah. and stuff like that, we would we're have much wise. more. No yeah. buying the big what, house. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we quite know what we're yes. doing now. We yeah. know that yeah. if the record company are paying for it, spend it. If they're not, don't. Yeah, yeah. but when the record company is spending it, you not learn. But what's really annoys me about this is that actually and it, and I hope it's changing and I, I don't know mm. but that you there are young people in this industry and there are adults manage them managing them yeah. where are those adults the responsible adults that are supposed to be looking after you mis they, they're not yeah. there really you know, you've got your agents you've got promoters you've yeah. got all of these people what are they doing this is something that at the time I used to say you know because there's like unions for workers yes. right but there isn't unions for pop stars right yeah and so it's it never I mean, I think people understand now what goes on, but I you're, you you're just a commodity. Get being told that you're lucky to have yeah. yes, you do. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, also yeah. and then you, you feel guilty about yeah. feeling down. Anything. Yeah. 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 Much more support now.